for about, I was living out of a car for about three years. Within those three years, I was still um, playing basketball and going to high school, so-called living the life of a normal high school basketball player and student uh, without anyone knowing. Sports kept me on track. Just a game of basketball was just an outlet to get away from everything else I'm dealing with that I was dealing with at home. So whenever I was frustrated, I would just go play basketball. When I'm not feeling so good, I can play basketball. And even if I'm not playing good, just doing that just made me feel better. And it was just a way to get away. So basketball to me was just everything. It was just everything I knew about, everything that I really cared about. It was a very amazing experience to be on the cover of Sports Illustrated. Uh, when, uh, the issue came out and I was just in shock. I didn't really believe that he actually used my picture as the cover of it because there were also three other kids that were in the, um, the feature. So it was just very eye-opening and just a blessing. I was getting a lot of attention from the Sports Illustrated. So I would, get, I would be in touch with college coaches and all they would mention was the Sports Illustrated. So I was getting a lot of false praise just because of uh, they wanted to recruit the, the Sports Illustrated kid, but um, Coach Maker and the uh, coaching staff here really showed a lot of interest in me other than just the Sports Illustrated. So that just kind of motivated me to you know, come on a visit here and see what it's like, and that just in led to me committing here and getting a scholarship here. Uh, yeah. um, always the type of person that uh, tried to look at the, the positive side of things. Um, whenever things are going wrong, I always try to see the good in it and never dwell on the negative, the negative things in life. Um, and it's just a blessing, you know. Um,